Sometimes it's hard to do what you're asked. Hey guys, welcome back to the Journey Today show. I'm Jeremy and this I'm James. Is, yeah. Uh, are you okay, Jeremy? Yeah, I, I, to be honest, I am a little freaked out about today's show. James, you know, mm. our, our big idea today is that God is always with me so that I can have the courage to do what he asks. Here's my problem. Our team got a hold of today's big idea and thought it would be fun to test our courage. Yeah. Why are they doing that? I mean, you know that we have immense courage. We will be able to do almost anything anybody asks of us. But just in case we're not sure, it's always good to come back to the Bible. And today's Bible story helps us to understand how to have courage when we get asked to do something that's difficult. But to, to help me tell today's story, we need to go somewhere else. Go somewhere else? Yeah, let's go. Okay. Follow me. All right, Jeremy, here we are around the campfire. Bible stories with James around the campfire. So today's story is all about Moses again. Now Moses had left Egypt long ago and he was out tending his flock of sheep when all of a sudden he came across a fire. Whoa, a huge fire in a bush. But the thing is, the bush wasn't burning up. He was amazed and then suddenly out of the fire came a voice, the voice of God, Moses. Moses! Moses was like, what? Take off your shoes, you're on holy ground. So he did, he took his shoes off. And then, well, God asked him to do something very, very scary. He said, Whoa. Moses, go to Pharaoh and tell them to set my people the free. The bad, evil, nasty yeah. Pharaoh? So Moses oh was goodness. like, I can't do that. No. I mean, I don't know uh. what to say. What am I gonna do? Uh. But God said, just tell them I am. And then God explained to Moses, he needs to have courage because God will be with him and help him to do this. And so he did. Moses had courage. He knew that God was with him and no longer was he scared. And off he went to tell Pharaoh to set his people free. This fire's hot. Yeah. <sighs> <sighs> That was a good story. Yeah. And hot. Oh, yeah. Okay. That Bible story, yeah. That was intense. That's hot. Yeah. It helps me, though, um, because Joanna and Haley have prepared these challenges for us to test our courage. <laughs> Easy. Wonder what they came up with. <laughs> Haley with our challenges. Okay. okay. So what, 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 what's going on here? We've got four hats. All right. So uh, they told me two of them are disgustingly gross and two of them will cause uh, serious pain, but none of them will kill us. Okay. So that's kind of, that's encouraging. So it's either going to be really gross, really painful, but it won't kill yeah. us. So Haley, we just pick under a hat. Yes. Any hat. Okay. Any hat. Gross or painful? Gross or painful? Who's going first? Me? Yes. All right. A bowl of ice. Take an ice bath. <laughs> he can't fit hey, in that. Uh, that's too small. You mean like a, you've actually got a bath? Yes. Like an ice. Okay, I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna take an ice bath. I have the courage. What's Jer Go on then. Go on then, Jeremy. Ice baths not. Mm -hmm. Oh, we talking about ice baths? Terrible. I, I don't do oh, gross no. well. Ooh, interesting. Eat a habanero. <laughs> a habanero. Do I, 
A habanero. Okay, habanero. That's like chili, yeah. That's like not a regular chili. You that's fed me a jalapeno already. <laughs> a habanero is like a hundred times hotter. Is it? Is it really? Yeah. It's a hundred times hotter than the normal. Okay. There's there's gloves. When's he doing it? Eating it now? I'll do it right now. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, here on the Journey Today Show. I don't know why I'm putting a glove on. Jeremy is gonna <laughs> I am eat a habanero chili in front of you. I and then I'm getting, maybe you'll need that ice bath after that. I am legitimately nervous. I have never done this. Eat it, eat it. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Wow, you just went for it all at once. And the... It's not... You just went for it. <laughs> oh my What's god. Oh, uh, are you allowed to drink? Is he allowed to drink? No. No. No water? <laughs> well, it didn't say that. It says eat the habanero. <laughs> okay. You're beginning it's, to go a little bit red. Your eyes are watering. My lips. Uh, now, when I was a are cop, I, yeah. Oh my God. When I was a cop, I got sprayed with pepper spray in the face, and it feels like I have swallowed <laughs> pepper spray. Like, it is... Like, All right, Jeremy, I'm going to just help you out here because you know what? Today's verse is going to help you have courage to get through this. Here it is, Joshua 1, verse 9. You can read this with me while Jeremy suffers. How long do I have to wait before I have water? Listen, here oh is what I'm commanding you to do. Be strong and brave. Do not be afraid. Do not lose hope. I am the Lord your God. I will be with you wherever you go. <laughs> Does that encourage you? Be strong and courageous. Isn't Jeremy brave? Uh, are you allowed to look at the other ones? I would. Ah! It's so hot. Just describe you. You're actually sweating now. Just describe to our viewers what exactly does it feel like? Like. Being pepper sprayed in the mouth down to the stomach, it hurts so bad. It's your stomach hurt. <laughs> Just down to about right here. Oh my. You ate it too quickly. You should have taken your time. You went. <gasps> <laughs> you, so bad. I didn't, you, you got saliva coming out your mouth. You can't even control your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Do you need some milk? <laughs> Oh, Jeremy, I'm, I'm genuinely impressed. <laughs> My lips are I really, on fire. I, I really don't think I'd have done that. And I guess I've got to do the ice bath now <laughs> to put some ice. <laughs> I bet that helped. Oh, my All goodness. All right, so I'm going to do it. Let's do this. I'm going to, Jeremy, you've inspired me. The scripture today has told me to be strong and brave. Let's do this. Where is this bath? Downstairs. All right, we're going. Let's do this. Outs outside. I'm gonna All right, we're going to have a nice start. Outside. Let's do this, Jeremy. Come on, let's go. Everybody got a question for you. God doesn't tell us to eat crazy hot peppers or freeze in ice. <laughs> what are things he actually tells us to do? You can also check out the scripture included on this question. But right now, press pause while James enjoys this bath. Oh, my feet. Question two, what are some things we can do to be strong and brave? so that we can do things God tells us to do. Whew. Press pause. Press pause. Hey, 
Hey guys, we hope you enjoyed today's show. We'll be back next week. Can't wait to see you. Have a great week. God bless everybody. Bye. I ate a habanero. You got it. It smells.